In this video, guys, I'm gonna talk about the dangers of keto. What's up, guys? Hong Nguyen here. Welcome to the channel. If you're new, consider subscribing. Here, we're all about fitness and martial arts for older guys. It's not always talking about martial arts, it's everything else that surrounds it. So that's why in this video, we're talking about keto. The dangers of keto, guys. The thing is, keto is a fad diet and it's not new. These three diets here existed before keto, but they're essentially the same thing. Essentially what they're promoting is high protein and fats, no carbs. The ketogenic diet, for those of you guys who don't know, is really about not eating carbs. All you're eating is proteins and fats essentially your body runs out of glucose and that's the main source of energy for your body and for your brain. From there, what happens is that your body produces ketones. So that means that it's breaking down fat using it as fuel. So that sounds cool, right? There's a lot of people have, who have lost weight on keto. It's not something that's sustainable and it's more for therapeutic use. You have a lot of body fat to lose and your doctor, you're followed by a doctor and your doctor recommends it, then that's fine for a certain period of time. After that, you do have to go back to a balanced diet. When your body uses ketones for fuel, what happens is that it causes a lot of acidity in your body. Because of that, it's too acidic. So therefore what happens is that your body is leaching calcium, potassium, and magnesium. It does that so that it can balance out the pH in your body. By doing that, what happens is that, well, you're eventually gonna become uh, deficient in minerals and electrolytes. Because of that, it could actually cause kidney damage. Before I became a trainer and all, I actually bought into the ketogenic diet and I tried it. It gets expensive. Like if you're buying meat, you know, meat all the time and, and fats, you know, like in the form of, uh, you know, like cheese and milk and so on and so on, it gets a little bit pricey. I read up more on it and I started learning and studying this on a regular basis. When I discovered this, calcium deficiency and, and potassium and magnesium, nah. If you stick to a protein, a very high protein diet and high fats, right? Of course, because you're following a ketogenic diet. Here's what happens. Too much proteins, too much fats, end up with cardiovascular issues, meaning heart issues. Just wanted to give you guys uh, an example here. Pro athletes, these guys always want the edge. They're ready to put themselves through all kinds of training, all kinds of diet, and none of these guys are on a ketogenic diet. And there's a reason for that, because your body needs carbs for fuel. It's the best source of energy for your body. Brain, that's what it, that's the best source of fuel. It's not fats, it's not fats. Let me know what you think below. Talk to me about coaching, hire me for coaching or whatnot. There's a link in the bio where you have all my information. There's a form you could fill out and then I'll reach out to you and we'll talk about it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.